get up to this ano ba? grabe yung ganda ng ano nila post nila and based dun sa mga napanood ko ibang vloggers nung pumunta sila dito sobrang lakas ng alon because this the other side of Boracay na maalon eh surprisingly that's not the case today and I hope until tomorrow while I'm still here okay the sand is fine very fine grabe sobrang powder nyo Ayan o, kita nyo yung pagka sobrang kapowder niya. Parang ganyan din sa ano, station 1 and 3. Ganda. And private to, hindi siya na-access na, it's not for public. Daw ah, pero meron akong nakilala na tourista din dito. Yung bigay ng insider na pag uh, may mga alam, private na individual that they can provide tours dito. Parang inaalaw naman na. Dahil nga, wala mo siya ng turista. So, siguro pag hindi na pandemic, parang they would not allow. Pero, ano mo na tao dito? Wala. Tsaka, sobrang white niya. Ang sand niya. Parang natuloy siyang artificial. Sa sobrang ganda niya. Yung pagka-white. Try na natin yung WATSA! Yung... Ay, sobrang white. Sobrang powder niya. Pag ginalaw ko siya Ayan. I hope you can see it Hindi ka masyadong anilag dito ng araw um, If you check into one of the um, hotels here like Belmont, Savoy and uh, there's another one that I forgot okay. It's hard for me to explain <laughs> So, I want you to experience it. So, go down at Tourism, ano? Ambassador ng Paracay. <laughs> Grabe yung pagka... Ano nang... Oh, parang 2 inches kagad yung lalim. So, if you are going to check in nga dito sa mga IRR na to, part ng turn nila is that. That one. It's the, what they call, the keyhole. Mayroon nang isa foreigner. Uh, and then siya. Okay, ano naman ngayon kung may foreigner? Nangyayalam ako. Swimming na ako. This is it. Two hours later. Para sa nang merong... Pinarawang ka. Hindi ako nasisilungan. Dito. Sabi ng side Beach Ooh. Parang ko sa ano Islands Parang may gano'n sa Hundred Islands May eh. pakweba Ah, residential area na to Namalit, Banlaw again Sa pool The next day 5.19am uh, Ito ako lang Yung Ah nila Sunrise Sunrise tour Tourist in the house Tourist to For the sunrise. Yes, sir. It's a next one. Yes, sir. Okay, okay big one. No problem. It's a group. Ah, uh, okay. No problem. So, next one, though. Ito muna. Up. Antay muna. Isang buong family kasi sila. So, dun ako sa... Mag-isa daw. Oh, oh. Ready na ang aking buwan. Doon na naman kami punta. Napit lang sa akin. Kasama naman sa tour ang gano'n.
So, ito na pala. So, ito yung um, sign lights nila. Keyhole. Parang part nila ito eh. It's been a while since I saw a um, sunrise. Kasi after then, tsaka usually gumigising. So, it's really nice to, um, to see this again. After a very, very, very long time. So, yun, after mo hotel, punta nito. Yun, actually, yun na pala yun. Alam mo yung mga ano pa, alam mo yung mga paranap pa na ano. But still a nice experience. Hindi na ako sasama sa van. Ida-jogging ka lang ako. Yeah. Um, Nakamiss din pa lang tignan itong sunrise. You can see the sun directly. Hindi siya harmful sa... Hindi masakit sa balat. Yan, parang ganun. It's parang it gives you energy. It gives me energy. For your sandals set kasi parang paggabi na. So medyo sluggish na ako paggabi, ganyan. So feeling ko when it's sunset, it's time for me to work na gives me lesser energy. Low energy, but I'm like low focus ka. Madi person din eh. Hindi lang obvious. Kasi tanghali ako nag-iisip. Come to my job. Kumbalis sa ibang tourists. Actually, ako na nakatira dito. Done na yung sunrise. But, um, I'm planning to go back sa hotel na magdajagin yun. Yung, yun lang. Yung area na to, para siyang Subic. Tsaka yun sa may Laguna, yung Ayala Estates. <laughs> Ganun siya. Tapos may parang may mga private residences dito ng mga ganda yung house. Ayan. Pagod. this vlog um, on how my experience was or is kasi nito pa ako sa Belmont Hotel no? siguro I'll start with the facade ng building very clean bagong bago talaga yung, yung hotel but basic yun kasi wala yung mga huge chandeliers well carpeted ng mga staircase kanan. hindi siya yung, yung fancy hotel basic amenities of a hotel in John like they have pool um, gym cafeteria bar na rin um, it's the only hotel that is very close dito sa White New Coast Beach so yun yung advantage nila o yung distance nang talaga siya I just opted to use their golf cart kapag ganito kainit pero pag sa morning o kaya hapon pinagjogging mga ako kanina umaga hindihan kahapon kagabi pabalik ng hotel naglakad lang ako yung mga staff nila staff sobrang babaet flat sila Wala akong na-experience na bad service, very courteous, very nice. Punta naman tayo din sa room. Yung room ko, maliit lang siya. Maganda lang doon lahat ng rooms kasi lang may balcony. Masarap mag-tumambay uh, doon. So, morning, while you have your ano, your morning coffee or tea. Pero may gusto mo lang na pwede ka mag-work. Actually, ganda meron sila talaga sinet up na work table. Just use your laptop for personal surfing or gusto talaga mag-work. Everything's new. Parang bathtub yun ako kasi yun yung pinaka-affordable na, na avail ko. Uh, Nakukuha ko siya sa Kluk. If you're a Kluk member, mas, mas malaki ng discount. I only got it for 2,300. Pero meron pa siyang discount kasi meron ako mga credits. Kasi mga Kluk member. Hindi naman frequent na, pero I've used Kluk for quite some time now. And nakaka-receive ka ng certain credits. So parang nabayaran ko lang dun is around 1,900 from 2,3. Not bad na rin, no? Doon sa building, meron silang mga garden din sa loob. Parang glass house effect. Tapos may outer garden. So, nakaka-relax siya. Hindi siya super fancy, but very relaxing. So, isa sa mga highlights dito na sa pupunta ko is of course yung private beach nila. Because the, the new coast is a private beach of Belmont. 
hindi naman mo mapansin if you are um, just touring. Wala naman kasi entrance yun sa beach. So I think, I think, no. Wala, hindi kami minahanap pa ng yung hotel Kiko pala. Okay, yung anything as proof. So yung beach na dito, taon siya kasi ganun daw sa Boracay. So ito yung Boracay Island, ito yung Boracay Island. May beach dito, tsaka yung beach dito sa ano ba? Sa each side. Kapag malakas yung alam sa habila, tahimik sa habila. Kapag tahimik naman, makalakas yung alam. So dun sa White Beach, yung where most tourists flock. Doon kasi ako nakastay. Uh, malakas yung alam niya. Pag pundan ko dito, tahimik siya. Ganito kasi yung alam sa White Beach palagi. Halos parang wala. Yung sand nila, very fine. White siya, lalo nakapag tinuman ng araw. Kaganya, sobrang white na, di ba? Nakakasilaw nga. Eh. The fact that it's a private beach, well maintained siya. Parati ko nakakita na merong tractor. Tractor. <laughs> Or basta ako ano yung tawag doon na ina-ice yung sand. And they have the package naman, yung sand lace package. So you have to just coordinate with the receptionist. Na gusto mong avail yung uh, sand rice, yung keyhole sand rice store nila. So basically, doon sa dulo ng beach ng Belmont or ng New Coast, parang merong nakreate na keyhole. Parang. So very Instagrammable siya. Yun. Ito pa yung maganda din dito. If you like walking in the morning or in the afternoon or jogging, eh, ang ganda. Eh, ang ganda. Ang ganda. Ang ganda. Kasi, yung area niya kasi, parang 90% na daw owned by Mega World. Maganda rin daan. Yung roads, yung sidewalks, or pavements. Yung stock niya parang BGC type na siya. Ganun. And they are selling condos here as well. So, might as well check that out. But going back, what else can you ask for? Having a very nice hotel, very gorgeous staff, the beach, the sand. Is it something that I would recommend Belmont for those who would like to travel? Definitely, definitely yes. Something uh, worth your time if you are here in Boracay and uh, worth the experience. Yon. I'm also planning one of these days to magbay to kabong ang Boracay Island. And I'll try to go here and see if magapaso ang nandiest dito sa beach nila. No. Siguro for sure it's going to be a different story if the travel ban or travel restriction has changed now. Ain lang. So that's my review. Um, sana marami kina ko ang tips and uh, hope you consider going here in Belmont and try other hotels. I mean, kung kaya niyo try lahat, try lahat. Diba? Support local tradition na tayo. So that's about it. Guys, thank you very much for watching. Stay safe. Let's follow the health and safety standards. Okay, para matapos na itong pandemic na to. And always choose to be happy whatever you're experiencing right now. Doon lang tayo. Just be happy. Okay? Alright guys, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the notification bell para maging updated ka sa aking mga kaganapan. Okay, bye! Nakalimutan ko sabihin pala yung food nila masarap. Sobrang sarap yung breakfast nila. Kasama dun sa binayaran ko, masarap. Pag pagkain talaga yun, first time ko nakalimutan ng pagkain sa review ko. Pero, sa diet ako eh. So, that's least of my priorities right now. Whoa!